We established this previously. The Oakland Raiders were gifted a game against the Cleveland Browns. <laughs> we all, don't call me a hater, bro. <laughs> you just agreed with me. Here's what happened. There were a few controversial plays. Here was the first of two that went against the Cleveland Browns who ended up losing in overtime to the Oakland Raiders in the Bay. This is just Carlos Hyde fighting. Look at him fight for those extra yards. Right there, that would have sealed the game with about a buck 40 left. Carlos Hyde, clearly, I know it's the unofficial line, but you know who doesn't think of it as unofficial? Every football fan. <laughs> so he gets over. The one thing that touched the ground was his elbow, okay? <clears throat> You know what else was needed? A second body part to touch. And as you're seeing right here, it was the elbow, the shoulder was not down yet, he gets the first down. That should have been game, set, match right there, okay? Once your elbow's but, down, that's it, I thought, though, right? No, you gotta have two parts down. If so like when it's your elbow. elbow and your arm, cool. But if it's just your elbow, no. Uh, I'll no. look up the rule, okay. So here's what else happened. There was a fumble, I'm sorry, there was an incomplete pass that should have been ruled a fumble. Take a look at that. Football just continues to fight and fight and fight, and that is a fumble, man. That, they, how is his progress stopped there? They called forward progress yeah. amazingly on this play. That would have been ran back as a fumble recovery touchdown for the Cleveland Browns, hosed on two straight calls. Two straight calls. So, what do we have here? Screwed out of that, job completely. John Gruden, hundred million dollar man, gets his first win with the Oakland Raiders. Okay, I, I, it's not a conspiracy theory, but it's a mentality of most people's theory for me in the NFL. Everyone's very excited about John Gruden coming back. What? Who? No, this the NFL in general. Like, if you're not if you if you're not a fan of a certain team that dislikes the Raiders or Gruden, ESPN is excited about John Gruden coming back because they oh, like John yes. Gruden. Oh, ABC, yeah. obviously, same company. The yeah. NFL in general liked John Marquette Gruden. He's King a, going up against him. Yeah, Very he, no, he's, a, he's a marketable like guy, right? Yeah. He's the guy that did the coaching things one on ones with every quarterback no, before man, Monday Night Football. You got to throw it in the tight window <laughs> there, Josh. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, and then the Chucky. The, how many times did I hear Chucky that first week when the Rams beat up? On if, if you um, took a sip of beer every time you heard Chucky, you would be as drunk as Brett Kavanaugh was at Yale. This, <laughs> this is the only... Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Craig. Did I go too far there? Cameras love showing the black hole, the guys with spiky uh, uh, shoulder pads on. But there's always somebody right behind the badass with the spiky shoulder pads with a <laughs> Chucky doll. Yeah. Who let that guy in with a Chucky doll? <laughs> like, oh, we're the badasses. We're sitting in the black hole. Here's my doll. That that's them. That doesn't match that's up. That's them. That, but that's how, that's how excited people are about John Gruden. You can come in with a doll and sit in the black hole and be accepted. Anyway, so because of that, I'm telling you, there's and it goes down to the officials and everybody. There's an excitement for seeing, the, wanting to see the Raiders win, and I think they got a little bit off of. Not again, it's not a conspiracy like they've mm -hmm. been told to do it. They just they're kind of leaning his way because everybody likes him. Let's go to this. Let's skip to 33. Dean Blandino's the former head of officiating for the NFL, now a rules expert for the NFL. I think we're all shocked. We're all looking at this here in the studio, and we're shocked that they overturned it. Again, you don't have a big line on the review. It's tough to tell exactly where the ball is. I wouldn't have overturned that one. <laughs> oh, really, fool? Really? Okay, so Derek Carr, then uh, his final line, 35 of 58, four touchdowns, about 440 yards. Two picks, QB rating is high, but he really didn't have an amazing game in my opinion. Baker Mayfield, two touchdowns, two interceptions, almost 300 yards on the day. The Oakland Raiders upcoming schedule to try and get a few more wins. They could easily, easily win four in a row. The Chargers look susceptible to losses right now. They didn't look great against the Niners. The Niners have CJ Beathard, except he was hurt in that game. The Colts completely threw away a game, which we're gonna talk about. They could easily get to five wins. But this is what's weird, though. If they again, if they'd gone 0 and 4, it could easily be 0 and 6 because I see the Chargers. They have enough of a high-powered offense to go ahead and, and run through the Raiders. Mm -hmm. Colts is such a who knows what they're going to do every week to week. Right. Um, but yeah, it's, it's a, they they needed to get on the right track. This is one of the things that can change some momentum for them, and I yeah, agree. it could lead to a string of wins. I agree. Um, so uh, Cleveland Browns were they hosed in your opinion? Yeah. I mean, anytime Same. you have, anytime you have the uh, the guys calling the game, 
that start saying things like, oh my God, oh, I wouldn't have done that. It sounds like sometimes, you know, when you listen to certain, any any sport, the homer call, right? Yeah. And you know, they're, they're kind of, I feel like they're What's told. What's the one rule of the homer call? Um, you, you don't say that the, that this is what happened. You say they're gonna say like in the NBA no. they'll go they're gonna and they're gonna say he traveled instead of saying he traveled. No, that's that's the I'm gonna give you approach. a hint. Names. Oh yeah, the first name. Only. First name only. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. I hate that so much. Um, and so, there goes Derek going yeah, baseline. Like, oh, and there's Taj with the alley oop dunk. Oh, and Carlos <laughs> making a good play up and under. Yeah. How about Jimmy making play? Like, yeah. Yeah. They they'll, they'll do so it that way. One rule. So anytime you have the non-biased calls saying things like, oh, that was really bad. Nope. The things that Homer calls would say, it must have been really bad. Absolutely. All right, let us know any thoughts, comment section below, subscribe to 2YT Sports. If you made it to the end of this video, mazel tov. If you want to see more, hit the bell and hit subscribe. Why don't you?